Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Tim Dale for leaving me their message sender and riff. Uh, what? Hang on a minute. This is my vlog. What are you doing? In today's vlog, my friends, we've got Timothy Dowd here. Come a little closer. Come on in. I've got the wide angle lens on. Not that I'm saying anything. Good to see you, man. I shouldn't say that, should I? I always say that to people. You've got the wide angle lens on. So I've got the wide angle lens on, and people say, What are you saying? Well, I've got depends on. You've got what? Depends. Depends. Yeah, the nappies. <laughs> I shouldn't tell people that either. Elasticated uh, exactly. trousers. Exactly. Yeah. Anyway, today we're going to go for. A full English breakfast for a change. Got a fly here. <laughs> What's that for? A flies attacking me. <laughs> that was, that was, don't worry. Hey, do you know what? It's December and it's brilliant weather. It's I'll amazing. tell you what, I ordered it for you because the Kalima arrived yesterday. Yeah. So you're going to get lovely warm weather. It's going to be a bit misty out to sea, so your drone footage is not going to look very good. But uh, it's going to be a great week. I'm going to be, it's going to be warm. Oh, yeah. What's that fly doing? What's going on? It's ruining my shot. It's me aftershave. <laughs> It smells good, actually. Mm. Right, full English breakfast. Uh, We're going to go to an old faithful. You t you messaged me this morning yeah. and said, where should we go? And I'm thinking, shall we have a wander around? And I said, do you know what? I think we'll go to the Olive Garden because they do a good sausage. Uh -huh. And you like a quality sausage. I do like a quality sausage. <laughs> why, why is that funny? I don't know. <laughs> anyway, if you're new to the channel, do me a favour. Hit the subscribe button. It's free. It's now. Pushing out. It doesn't. Well, actually, I'm charging a tenner at the moment. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but you know, that's probably why I haven't got as many as you. <laughs> Head over to this guy as well. And I was looking at Reed. Rest, rest, restraint. Restraint. I read it as restaurant. <laughs> that's, that's what I read it when I bought him. But... <laughs> anyway, subscribe to this guy. Uh, his link will be on the end at timothydowd.com. Exactly. Dot com. Dot com. <laughs> now, you too can have an actor like mine for only thirty nine ninety five down on three easy payments. No, 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 no. Can you do in your voice? Because he has got the voice a, a little bit closer like that. Now, no. without further ado, let's go. Now, ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, let's go. Right, here we are, Los Cristianos. Gonna head over to, uh, what's it called? Olive, yeah, Olive Garden. Garden. The Olive Garden. We've yeah, also Olive got Garden. cases behind us. Right. I've had many a night in cases, many moons ago. Can't remember them though. No. <laughs> and- uh, The Jameson Cloud. The Jameson Cloud. Um, Tim's just given me this. Not sponsored by the way, but it's great. It's got like loads of, what's it do? It's basically an anything to anything connector. USB-C type two, type three, micro, um, what's the other thing? All the different, all the different lightning, lightning to USB, USB C to USB, all the different stuff. It's fantastic, and a little magnet thing like that. I like that. Right, breakfast time. Breakfast. Full English. Uh, no, for me it's just a, a little bowl of muesli. A, really? Yeah. A little bowl of little muesli. bowl of muesli. A little bowl with of muesli. sausage, egg, bacon, <laughs> like pudding. I like your style. Come on. <laughs> Right, my friends. Okay, so here we are at the Olive Garden in Los Cristianos. I've been here before, and it is a fantastic breakfast. But it, it was last time I was here because they do all of the best produce. If you want a good sausage and a quality sausage, I do like a good sausage. You do like a good sausage in the morning. I love a big sausage in the morning. <laughs> That's why we've gone. For oh, you can have a flat sausage here as well. You can have a flat sausage, but I'm not having a flat sausage. <laughs> Listen, I can hear people going, this is be getting childish now. It's getting childish. Well, I tell you what, whoever finds it funny, you're invited to the party. If you don't, you're not. 
<laughs> so there's a load of stuff on here for the breakfast okay mm -hmm. you get a little qr code yeah. uh, that you can scan on your phone for your actual menu still here? We could actually, no. no she's she's stop, taken stop, that stop. Uh, but then if you haven't got a phone because i said being the awkward one yeah. and you'll have to put up with this guy he's come back again he's he's he keeps coming around here to clean the floor um i said what what happens if you haven't got a phone exactly there's always one isn't there always one yeah it wasn't got a phone these days and then then you get this little ipad thing or whatever it is it's an android device with all your menus on it uh, so take a look at the menu my friends Right, so there you go, my friends. There's the menu. Now, because they didn't have the muesli. No, so what I thought, probably did. similar, uh, I thought I'd have the mega extreme breakfast. <laughs> and add the black pudding to it uh, as yeah, well. Yeah, because they don't do the black pudding. Doesn't come with black pudding on, on the that. On the Scottish one, doesn't it? Yeah, it comes on the Scottish one. It comes one. on the Scottish one by accident. Yeah. Not by accident. <laughs> But I just nudged the Scottish one and it sort of dropped And it out. just yeah. dropped onto the mega English extreme. taking over Scotland again, I mean, you know, Yeah, because it was flat sausage with the uh, Scottish one. I don't one. mind a flat sausage, but I you fancy a banger. That, by the I fancy way. a banger, you know? You've got all the Scottish now going, it's not a flat sausage, it's a lawn sausage. A lawn. I think that's what it's called. Okay. Do they play lawn tennis on it? I think it's L-O-R-N-E. Ah, <laughs> as in lawn green. Yeah. There you go. What's this low sauce? But and you, it's don't, clear, you don't like a flat sausage, do you? Um, I'm, I prefer the banger. I don't say I don't like it, I just prefer the banger. So you, you like a, a proper light big sausage? Yep. Pardon the pun. Do you know what? If you don't find this funny, there's a few people out there going, oh, this is absolutely disgusting. It's this like is... a carry-on movie. Well, I'll tell you what, then you're not invited to my party. But those <laughs> who are laughing at it, you're invited to my party. A good party, by the way. Gotta have a little bit of a laugh, haven't you, these Yeah, I'm gonna be a bit of a laugh. I've been all six in my mouth, won't we? There we go. Shall we read what it is? It's two pork sauce. You actually, you read it with your voice. Oh, and maybe. then a little bit of into the camera. This then. is the mega extreme, right? Yeah, Not yeah. the extreme, because there is an extreme. Yeah. But now there's the mega extreme. Mega extreme breakfast, two pork sausage, two fried eggs, two Danish bacon, bean Branston beans, fresh or plum tomatoes, hash brown, two buttered toasts, and you can either have brown or white. Yeah. And fresh mushrooms. There you go. Four? Four, seven. Pounds, uh, seven, seven euros, euros ninety seven, pounds. Seven pounds, what less, less than seven quid. Do you know what? I, I, it's you tell a proper Brit, can't you? Because seven pounds. Seven pounds. I used to say dollars for years. Dollars. So there you go. And we've had two lattes, or is it latte? Uh, I call it milk coffee myself, but that's another one. Can I have a milky coffee? Mm -hmm. Do you know what? Actually, it is. Where did latte and latte come from? Because years ago it was like my mum would go, oh, yeah. Do you want your coffee made with milk, a milky coffee? I'm like, Yeah, I'll have a milky coffee. That's what it is. It's just a milky coffee, isn't it? It's actually a latte. Uh, it's a latte, is it? A latte. A latte. A latte. A latte. Anyway, we'll wait for the breakfast and we'll see you guys in a minute. Right, my friends, okay, well, this is absolutely huge. I'm not sure if I'm going to manage all this, and there's lots of bread as well. Uh, so before we go any further, take a closer look, my friends.
Right, there you go. Now for my favourite part, and that is when I get the special guest to make an absolute tool of themselves by doing the thumbnail. And a lot of people have yeah. divided on this. You get, it's childish, I don't like the thumbnail. Then you get other people going, well, I actually love the thumbnail, it's a bit of a giggle. Those who don't find it funny, fast forward. And I'm not inviting you to my party because it, it, you've got to be fun at parties to do this bit. And Tim is fantastic at it. So just look, he is actually one of the best thumbnail people in the business or in the world. Can you give it a, ooh. ooh? Can you get a bit loud like a, oh? <laughs> now a, ooh. ooh. <laughs> <laughs> it's difficult when people are watching, isn't it? Knickers, knackers, knackers. Hmm, look at that. <laughs> I better, I'm, I've got people watching. They actually found it amusing, by the way. <laughs> the, right, here we go. Ready? I'll do it. I'll take it seriously. <gasps> Ooh, look at that. <laughs> Can't do it. I'm your child, look. Ooh. <gasps> Sausage. Hang on, what, hang on one second. That's hot. Right, my friends, okay, so what I'm gonna do first is I've got a plate here because I'm gonna decant my bread onto there. Okay, so I've got a little bit more room on my plate because this is nice quality bread. Absolutely, look at that, look at that, it's like it's a, a wedge. And, the, and you get the option of having white or brown. So I got, oh, what's it called? Granary. It's not brown, is it granary? Granary. Oh, it's granary. Yeah. It's perfect, thank you very much. Uh, so white or granary, I'm gonna decant my beans. Now then, what you have to do is, I don't know whether you know this, yeah. keep the beans. Yeah away from the egg all right right so no no beans in your egg no we don't want any we don't want any invasion of the beans to the egg you mean like that yeah oh you can't look at what he's done that's sacrilege uh, sacrilege you never, you never mix, mix the beans with the egg you use your sausage as a breakwater so we'll stick the beans on there <laughs> the sausage doesn't last long <laughs> uh, we've got the hash brown here we've got the eggs um which are not snotty. I would have. I should have asked them to be whitened, whitened over the top. Good quality bacon. Um, I've got the tomatoes there, which is a fresh tomato. But you've got the plum tomato. Yeah. Normally I would go for that, but we wanted to show you a difference, so that's why we've gone for it. Nice quality mushrooms there as well. They are good. The mushrooms. I tried those. Yeah. Got mm. the sausage, which is in Spain. Where do you get like a? A pork sausage, like mm. a, a butcher's one. Where do you get that from? <laughs> to tell you the truth, the only place I would get a butcher's sausage from is the meat boutique in Ikisur. And Ikisur is the it used to be Grand Sur in Costa Deque. Yeah. But it's called Ikisur now. And Ikis is the Spanish word for X. Is it a butcher's? It is a butcher's, but they got a they got a restaurant out the back. Really? Yeah. I think you should take me to that. We shall go. Is it far? No. Oh, right, it's just up. It's about six hundred yards from your hotel. Really? Yeah. Up, up the hill across the motorway. It's right there. We shall talk about that one and go there later as well. We've got HP. Now that's odd. You don't have sauce. No. But no sauce. I used to have sauce. Yeah. And then everything tasted the sauce. There we go. Right. There's the sausage. We're going for that. A little bit of brown. It's actually on there. good. It looked like a. It looked like a catering sausage, but it's actually a very tasty. It is sausage. It is very tasty. A little bit herby as well. Yeah, I've I got think some um, herbs in it. it's not. It's not your standard, so it's it's a top quality. That's it. Mm. Good quality bacon. There, you can tell that. They said they've changed the supplier on the bacon because uh, they wanted a better quality bacon. So I'm going to go in for it now. Okay. And you don't normally get this bacon here. You usually get the streaky bacon. Yeah. So I'm going to go for it. Nice, mm. slight saltiness to it. So you may be asking why am I using my fingers? Because I found that. Eating food with fingers tastes better. Do you know a lot of countries in the world, mm -hmm. Kuala Lumpur being one of them, Malaysia, mm -hmm. use their fingers. You eat from banana leaves. I went a few times to Kuala Lumpur ah. and uh, they eat with the fingers and it's supposed to taste better. Oh. Fish and chips. Shout out to Larry from Ipoh. And we've got on here, that's what we've got on here, the hash brown. I'm going to cut into the hash brown. Mm. Fluffy hash brown. Now it is good. It is good. Hash brown or fried bread? Well, I would go for fried bread, but hash brown wasn't a thing when I was in Britain. So they, they, they invented that, or they brought it over from America after I left. Very controversial hash browns. 
In Britain, yeah, but I mean, I lived in America for five years and they were quite normal. These these aren't the hash browns they had in America, are they? No. They had, like, it was a different kind of hash brown. Well, they just made them. These are, these are the McCain stuff, you know? Yeah. Right, beans, bean test. It's actually Branston. Are they Branston beans? Yeah. How did you know that? It says on the menu. Oh, there we go then. I don't read, didn't read the menu close enough. Yeah. Really nice. Um... I don't, I don't like the fact that they're on top of the egg, though. What, the beans? No. You poured them on it. Oh, I did, didn't I? <laughs> right. Just look at that bread, though. That's mental. We'll see you guys in a minute. Because you just want to eat it now, don't you? Mm, I'm just uh, savouring it. <laughs> it does... That's enough for me, mother. Uh, is that muesli? This is the muesli. That's the muesli. Mm -hmm. It's actually... I think it is, actually, isn't it? I think black pudding is muesli. It's sort of muesli. Mm. Mm. Oh, my word. Oh, yeah. That's that red. Good? Yeah. Got a slice of uh, brown. I'm, I'm all right. Brown bread makes me uh, stomach turn a little bit, to be honest. Yeah. yeah. I don't know why. But there we go. We'll eat this. And then we'll come back to you. Can you say, see you guys in it after the break? We'll see you guys after the break. I can't finish the rest. I can't finish the rest, mate. What, it's too three much. Three beans. <laughs> oh, go on then. <laughs> right. Okay. Let's get down to business. First of all, the price. I reckon seven euros ninety-five for that breakfast is excellent. Excellent. Here's a copy of the receipt. However. You picked up on this for the black pudding, another two euros. That was a quarter of the price of the whole breakfast mm. for one slice of black pudding. I wouldn't have had it if I'd have known. Um, so I think that's a, I think that's a little overpriced on the black pudding. Um, if I'm being honest, I would. The, the quality of everything is fantastic. The mm. bread is brilliant. The bacon's excellent. It just God, it winds me up. You know what I'm going to say? Yep. Sausage. Sausage. It's like I look and I think, oh come on, give me a proper butcher sausage. I think bending it. I was disappointed when I saw it, but the taste was fantastic. I must admit, if I'd have, if I'd have blind eaten it, I wouldn't have noticed. Yeah, it it was okay, and the beans were nice. Branston, Branston, uh, and the bread was lovely. <laughs> and I think I think the bread was too much for me. There is a lot of bread. A lot of bread. Yeah, I mean, like the bread. door door stops. And one slice would have been enough. One slice cut in half would have been enough. Yeah. Um, Latte, lovely, fantastic place, really good quality. Uh, as I say, just the sausage. So I'm going to go with a. I'm going to go with a eight point nine. Okay. Cool. I'm just going to go with the ten because I live here, and you never know who's going to be lurking in the background. Well, I don't think eight point nine is good. Yeah, it is good. It is good. Yeah, and I would definitely. But I told him. I told him it was going to be a ten. All oh, right. Before so. before we started, so <laughs> I've got to give a ten. Uh, other than that, I would, just, I would just say that the one ninety five for the black pudding. Was a bit two euros. Uh, two euros, yeah. Yeah. Anyway, on that bombshell, uh, thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to this guy. His name is Timothy Dowd. D O W D. And uh, I'll put his link in the end and in the description down below. Do me a favour. He is a very, very good friend. Goes back a long way. Long way. Uh, from Tenerife lockdown. over here. From before lockdown. Before lockdown. Way before lockdown. Yeah. So there you go. So. This guy is amazing. Salt of the earth. Head over and subscribe to him. He's got a great channel. And uh, I love him to bits. So I'll see you guys in the next one in a manly way of course manly manly manly, manly. Yeah. anyway unless honest. you're a woman watching and then i love you in a womanly way and on that bombshell see you in the next one <laughs> platonic way a platonic way platonic <laughs>